Tonga's underwater volcano that produced a spectacular eruption in January remains amazingly intact. A New Zealand-led team has just finished mapping the flanks of a seamount, which many think may have been torn apart in the ferocity of the event. But structurally, Hunga Tonga Hunga Hapai has not changed much. The Tonga eruption produced the largest atmospheric explosion recorded on Earth in more than a century. This generates tsunamis in the Pacific and in other ocean basins around the world. It even lifted the clouds over England, 16,500 kilometers away. Fortunately, only a handful of people lost their lives in the Tonga Kingdom. Although there is clearly a lot of ash deposition and sediment movement, the volcano is still standing tall. The expedition leader, Niwa marine geologist Kevin McKay, said he was surprised by what he saw in the Tangaroa research vessel, RV, sonar data. Given the violence of the eruption on January 15, I expected the building to collapse or fall apart, and this did not happen, he explained. While the volcano appears intact, the seabed shows some of the dramatic effects of the eruption. There are fine sandy mud and ash ripples within 50 kilometers of the volcano, with gouging valleys and large piles of sediment. From a survey of 22,000 square kilometers, Tangaroa's team calculated about 6 to 7 cubic km of material had been added to the seabed. It is ashen rock that is initially ejected by a volcano into the air, but then falls back into the water and down the slopes of an underwater mountain to flow to the seabed. This density, or pyroclastic flow, was a major factor in generating the tsunami waves that inundated local islands, said McKay.